What's up you guys, it's your Violet Taylor here and welcome back to Let's Catch a Vibe. Now I hope, was, I hope, I hope everyone's feeling great, feeling amazing, feeling vibey. As you guys can see, we have a brand new Is or Is It Not Worth It Bond of video on the Assassin's Creed Mirage Deluxe Pack or I like to call it the Prince of Persia Pack. So this was a pre-order um, pack. Obviously you can buy it but you could get it earlier on if you just pre-ordered it. So let's jump straight in. Start us off, we have the description, we have dress yourself as a prince and play with the sands of time to turn the world of Baghdad into a wondrous tale in which the flow of time can be manipulated. So, as I always say at the beginning of, every, of all these videos, this pretty much gets unlocked when you reach the, Har the, the Harabia um, Bureau in Baghdad. Obviously, you have to complete the Assassin's Training in Alamut first. So yeah, you do get to the Bureau quite early. It's the first quest you, you pretty much get when you um, reach Baghdad. So moving us on to the top item, we have the Sand Outfit. Light, extravagant fabric moves with fluid grace. Now, the perk of this skin is, once during a conflict, Basin can survive a lethal hit and slow down time for three seconds. So you aren't always dead. You can survive like a hit that you wouldn't be able to normally. Anyway, moving us on to a die that comes with this deluxe pack. We have the Desert Sands Initiate of Alamut. So, a customization that uses shades of the desert and the dunes for the Initiate of Alamut outfit. So, pretty much gives us a, um, a die for our standard assassin, um, assassin um, outfit. If you guys have played the game, you'll go, you guys will know this is the standard um, assassin outfit you get. Moving us on to the first weapon, we have the Sand Sword. Lives this blade, steals can heal its wielder. Or sorry, st steals can heal its wielder. Very, very confusing. I had to reread that when I looked at it. I was like, lives, I'm oh, sorry, lives, this blade steals can heal its wielder. I thought it was live. Anyway, the perk is killing an enemy while time has slowed down regenerates 20% health. Now, using this is really, really good in combination with the dagger of time oh my god absolutely amazing legend says the sands within can control time so the perk perfect parries slow down time for three seconds so if you parry somebody you're going to slow down time then if you um kill an enemy which you can when as soon as you parry somebody most of the lower tier enemies once you parry you can insta kill them so not only will you generate up to 20% extra health, so especially if you are playing on like harder difficulties, but you will also slow time for three seconds. And in combination with if you are low on health as well, you will be able to survive a hit. You'll be able to gain your health back and you'll be able to put some extra hits in. Now, moving us away from the um, items, we have the cosmetics. So we have the first off for our, for our eagle, we have the sand eagle. This mysterious eagle gives the impression of gliding on the currents of time itself as it soars through the air. I mean, man, it just looks absolutely amazing. Really, really cool. Moving us on to a, for a skin for our horse mount, we have the sand horse. A swift and sorry, a swift and intelligent mount that seems that uh, a swift and intelligent mount that sees. That, sorry, that seems to slow time itself as it speeds across the dunes. Ugh, my, my tongue just wasn't spitting out the words there. But overall, it is a really, really good looking uh, mount for our horse. Last but not least, isn't an item, but we do have the Hourglass of Time, which you can pretty much wear on your, um, on your outfit. You can have this on any outfit, so don't worry about trying to transmog it. This talisman is shaped like an hourglass. According to legend, one such vessel was sought to contain sands that held a fearful amount of power uh, that would wreak havoc if ever unleashed. <laughs> a nice little what you would call an accessory. But guys, that was the Assassin's Creed Mirage Deluxe Pack. Now again, if you bought the digital deluxe version of the game, which I did, I bought the physical copy. I got this, um, I got this and the um, 40 Thieves um, quest pack. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, you can just buy this. I don't know how much this is because it won't tell me because I've already bought it. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button. If you didn't enjoy the video, let me know in the comments down below why you didn't like the video. Also, let me know which is your favorite item from this pack. Are you guys going to get this pack? And also, which was your favorite Prince of Persia game? 
But anyway, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new and join that catch up fight. Also, if you are new, please don't forget to push the bell notification to get notified as soon as I upload. But more importantly, don't forget to stay by me and I'll catch you in the ride. Peace.